Channel 5 series All Creatures Great and Small will be returning to viewers' screens later in 2022 and will see the residents of Skeldale House entering the year 1939. Season 2 saw James Harriet, played by Nicholas Ralph, and Helen Alderson, Rachel Shenton, finally get engaged after two seasons of back-and-forth chemistry. Nicholas recently teased his co-star and claimed he had carried her through two series speaking at the BFI and Radio Times Film Festival, the cast touched on how they felt like a family and all fit in with one another easily. Nicholas explained, Yeah, it is a surrogate family, and James finds himself a brother and surrogate parents, and beyond that, we move forward. But yeah, going back, it was art imitating life in a way in terms of that I, like Alf, graduated from drama school in Glasgow, and this was my first TV job. I was on the train to the Yorkshire Dales to start my first job like he was when he started his first job at his veterinary practice under Siegfried. Siegfried actor Samuel West has also been known to talk about how easy it is to film, with Rachel quipping, I can't stand him actually. Moving on to her co-star Nicholas, she said, I am joking, we get on really well all the cast, from the off. Nick and I did our screen test together back in 2019. Nicholas interrupted and joked, My back is still sore, carrying her through two seasons. Rachel's mouth dropped wide open before the pair cracked up laughing with one another, continuing to show their bond. Touching on Helen's introduction to Skeldale House, Rachel admitted, this season we saw at the end she moved into Skeldale and was the implant in the house. As we have seen, these guys have it all sorted, a rhythm, and they all know each other, so it's her settling in and finding that groove, but of course, I think she has an instant advantage in that she isn't employed by Siegfried. She is the one who isn't that intimidated by him because he doesn't pay her way or anything, that has always been the way it has been with Helen and Siegfried, she isn't so wary of him like some of the others in the house were. But it is funny because I never did any scenes in Skeldale other than when Helen went to visit James, in this season, I have started filming there, and there was this adjustment period where I had to find my place at the table. Where does she sit? And I felt like that for real because I have watched the scenes, and these guys are around the table and felt like this wasn't quite mine. Callum Woodhouse who plays Tristan Farnan added, I have lost my seat at the table now because of that. The Channel 5 series is an adaptation of the series made by the BBC and is based on the books of the British veterinary surgeon Alf White who wrote under the pseudonym James Harriet. Speaking about the initial plans to begin producing another series which looks at Alf's life, producer Melissa Gallant explained, there was a need for a show that wasn't cynical and brought families together. Thinking back to the amazing 70s and 80s BBC series, it was a show that brought generations together, and I think the world of laptops and television is a connected experience. So we wanted to make a show that the family could sit and watch, and many just loved the experience of the books and the show, and it makes you feel a certain way. It is a great experience, it makes you laugh and cry, truthful, painful and funny, so that was it, then we went to speak to Jim and Rosie, Alf White's children, we have been able to talk to them. They have been completely brilliant and generous, they were really excited about Harriet's story coming to a new generation. All Creatures Great and Small Season 3 will air later in 2022.